Hey YouTubers, just making you a, uh, a quick little video on how to change your gauge cluster bulbs on a, uh, a Toyota pickup truck. Uh, this is a 1988 Toyota 4x4, but I'm sure it's the same for all late 70s to 80s um, pickup trucks. Uh, to change them out, basically you have to remove this piece of the dash first. There's two small screws here, two bigger screws in here. There's one right here on the side. There's one right here, and one right here. Basically, you remove all those, and this piece will come off with a little persuasion. The, uh, the clutch start cancel switch is still hooked up, so uh, you can either unplug it, or uh, just move it out of the way, which is what I did here. All right, so after that, there's four screws to get the cluster out. One, two, three here, Four here, remove those four screws. Then there's gonna be three plugs in the back. There's one here, one here, and one here on the back side. And then right in the middle on the bottom is your uh, your, your Speedo uh, cable. You have to unplug all those, pull this out. Then there's gonna be a little twist lock, guys, with these, uh, these bulbs in it, which in my case were burnt out. Uh, and then I went ahead and I bought LEDs off eBay. These cost a dollar for a pair. For this cluster, I only need two. I believe for the one with the uh, the tachometer, I think you need three, but I can't confirm that because I don't have one. Um, change those, test it, because LEDs are directional, so if you put the bulbs in backwards, it won't work. In this case, it works, although it's hard to see in the daylight. Um, and then put it back together. Getting the, the Speedo cable on is a little bit tricky, but uh, once that's on, then you just assemble in the reverse order and you're good to go. Hope this helps. And we're all lit up at night. Came out really nice. It's quite a bit greener than the original green, but uh, it looks good. The cool part about these is that the gauge faces are actually white. It's the bulb color that dictates what color the gauges are going to be. So if you get red bulbs, they'll be red, or blue will be blue. And they have cool little diffusers inside the gauge cluster, so there's no hot spots. It all lights up very nice and evenly. So, uh, so it's a pretty cool mod. Pretty cool mod, pretty cheap. Hope this helps.